fighter aircraft deployed by the Nigerian military have been combing some communities in Delta State and raining strikes on forests which are suspected to be hideouts of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB. Sahara reporters learned that there is panic in communities, communities such as Anwai in Asaba, Okwashi and Ugbolu as the military aircraft rain strikes. Residents have said the aircraft they sighted flew low over houses. The helicopters passed two times this morning and then we had booms. They are targeting non-existent IPOV and where, had, where were they when faceless Fulani Yesmen wrote a threat letter to attack Delta State. The military aircraft has been disturbing the sanity of our communities and this should stop. We have babies, small children and aged persons who can die from shock. A resident lamented as he spoke with Sahara reporters. The State Commission of Police, Mohamed Hari, confirmed that a security team led by the Nigerian Air Force, NAF, led an operation where some IPOP were bombed in Delta State. Earlier, Hari had said the police used helicopter in the state capital and ran a law to despise members of IPOP and send a signal to them that the command is in charge. He said, a lie in the base of I is the base of IPOP. They come from Onicha, Anambra State, to regroup in a lie. We must tell them they are not welcomed in, in the state. That state will be hot for them. Once we identify them from the hair, we shall make sure we send them packing. And if care is not taken, deal with them the way they want. But the Atom Police Public Relations Officer, DSP, Bright Idafi, described the tension in the area as holds. Idafi said people were just spreading rumors, insisting that there was nothing like an attack in the community. There is nothing like that in Okpanam. The area is peaceful. If they hear a gunshot, they will begin to specul speculate about what is not happening. I can tell you that what is going on in Okpanam is a situation issue, which I will not discuss in public, Idafi said. Residents in, in the state capital, Asaba, and neighboring towns, including Okpanam, have become more security conscious since last month. Anomities later threatening to attack Asaba and Abo. If Governor Ifan Okowa does not withdraw his support from the ban on open grazing in the southern part of the country, the bombing caused tension in Asaba, the capital of Delta State, especially part of a La community, which is mainly not local government area, as a combined team of policemen and military officers use helicopter to raid the area. <laughs> And they refuse to use these same tactics to bomb bandits, kidnappers, and Boko Haram in their known hideout. They are innocent people. Stop killing them. There is nothing like IPOP's camp. This government is based. You can't arrest Fulani killers and bandits killing hundreds in Zamfara. You'll be Kaduna Kano doing Allah's work as a northern part as Northerners put it and supported by every Northerner, but you can arrest those peaceful agitators who haven't killed anyone. These are Nigerians' reactions, and they are still talking. In the mention of ESN and IPOP, Northern, Ewu will be clapping and will be jumping out with their witches. If we Southerners, both the elites and the masses, don't come together with one mind to repair this Fulani, uh, to repair this Fulani, it is going to end in fiasco. You can't dare such nonsense on Northerners because they will fight you with one mind. It is high time we parted the way because obviously we don't have like mind. It is now a cause to be in Nigeria. Oh, wow. Suspected. This is how they go about killing innocent Nigerians. God will destroy each and every one of them. In Jesus' name, he said, 
Very good job, NEA, NEAF. I, I thank you for your understanding, for you have actually understand the language they will understand. The war has just started. For those rejoicing, well, it's hope. It won't consume all of us. 2021 is not 1963. A referendum is the only solution. Listen to them like you did bandits and Boko Haram. IPOP is not a terrorist group in anywhere. It must not, it must, that nothingness that support the killers of their friends will receive God anger, heavy sickness of no cure. God is angry at the moment against the people that support the killings just because of power is in the north. The language has been spoken well for their comprehension. Whenever you see a python dancing in the city, know that the python has been defeated in the forest. Nigerian security agencies always love to pursue shadows and neglect the real thing. Shame on them. <laughs> Tribulation time, they can bomb anywhere they will like, but nothing is going to happen to God's children. No British citizen can be removed inside or outside British without the knowledge of the British government. The world is not ready for an unstable Nigeria. Kano's arrest, a web of well-managed interconnectivity. The British government knew of this arrest and stopped President Muhammad Buhari from making his uh, whatever things he's doing. We all understand this point of correction. Nabdekano was not arrested in the UK. According to his family member, he was arrested in Kenya. Now, wow, Nigerian government and military should play with caution before these attacks escalate to unrest. Arresting, bombing, and killing people here and there is not the solution to Nigeria's problem. So, guys, before I head it now, I'm going to drop it here. What's your view on this? Let's hear from you. Hit the comment section. Thank you very much. Bye for now. Thank you.